happened to me twice and happened to many of my friends. So in New York, when you go to clubs or restaurants, it was actually a discussion we'd have. What do you do with the bag? And so I love this. It immediately made some oh, rolls this way. It's very light and it goes on the table just like this. And, right. and we have and the bag have... goes right underneath. Perfect. And there it is. And you can put it, you know, on your side or in front of you. You know, this is one of those products where you hit your head and you're like, duh. <laughs> exactly. For women, that is exactly the, the situation. For me, anyways, it was duh. I constantly was looking for a place to put my purse everywhere we went. It gets the purses yeah. up off the floor. I'm convenient. I'm not worried about it. Yeah, you can put it under the table. You can put it on the chair. To San Diego's most popular local morning news, Good Morning San Diego. All right, let's check in with Rod Luck now at the sports arena with... Uh, the inventor of purse hooks. Hey, yeah, it's Imagine that. Sports that. Arena, right behind the sports arena in the sports arena area. And now, I don't know, Bridget, if you remember back in the in 1990s, they had a purse caddy where you could put something on the counter. Sure. Family and family is the ones that invented this thing. Well, you didn't because you, you kind of copied, but you didn't, and you changed the old purse well, caddy. The first purse hook started in 1906, actually the original patent. But we just made ours better. My sister had actually found one at a garage sale. Um, years ago, and once we finally figured out how to how, what it was for, um, we used it. Purses, you, got a, you got a computer case there jackets, for a laptop. baby bags, purses, hats, anything, anything you want. Laptops. Nicole, good idea. Put